Happy Thursday. Uh, today we finish Luke 14 with the topic on, of humility. Um, it's a couple of parables there, and they're, they're, it's not the only point that's being made, but, um, it's, and it's also not the only place where we see the topic of humility developed. It has developed so many other places in the Bible. The topic of pride, the advocacy of humility, very common themes. Uh, 1 Peter 5.5 5, uh, we're told, clothe ourselves with humility towards one another because God opposes the proud but uh, shows favor to the humble. This, again, is not just good business advice. It's a path towards the life that works, and it's a path towards eternal reward. So, um, look, I, I want to I say we're taking, you're going to take a final exam where you know the test questions. Uh, and, and one of the test questions is, you know, how did you humble yourself? How did you serve other people? There's no reason to get a bad score on this. We have to be a little bit more proactive. And so there's a couple things to do. First of all, uh, just we know this from the writings of the saints and other things. If you focus on humility, <laughs> it doesn't really work. It tends to promote pride. Focus on Jesus, right? If we focus on being humble, just sort of doesn't work. Uh, we tend to feel, look at me, I'm focusing on being humble. I'm a pretty good guy, better than that guy. So don't focus on being humble, focus on Jesus. Secondly, um, there can be times to just reflect, uh, to be quiet and to let the Spirit of God bring to mind times when you were not humble. Um, I have, I've talked about this over the last few years now, added sort of times of silence uh, and just quiet to my mornings. And I have to tell you, I love that time, uh, except when I have this just overwhelming conviction like, oh my goodness, did I say that yesterday? <laughs> oh my goodness, did I miss that yesterday? Did I, was I so self-absorbed that I missed what that person said? Oh my goodness, those can be painful moments. Uh, but they lead to uh, confession and they lead to uh, opportunities sometimes to sort of correct some of those things and they lead to, uh, to ways to say, okay, I want to do better. So uh, you can ask the Lord to sort of help you see yourself a little bit more clearly. Uh, you could stop and reflect on your day and let the Holy Spirit uh, bring to light those areas where you missed it. And again, uh, don't set out to be the most humble person that you can be. No, set out to be the most absorbed with Jesus person you can be. That's the path to humility. Have a good day.